Today I'm excited to review this 18 inch portable monitor from Uperfect. So let's get started. And if you guys are planning to buy one of these, I put the link in the description. Please make sure you guys check it out. So in the box, it came with the monitor itself and the monitor is attached to an adjustable stand. Then we have these two USB-C type cables, one HDMI to mini cable, a 30 watt type C wall adapter, and finally the instruction manual. Now talking about the specs, this is an 18 inch monitor and it has a 2K display, which means it has a max resolution of 2560 by 1600 plus this one comes with 144 hertz refresh rate so that means it's going to be super awesome for gaming and multitasking i've actually tested so many games on this and i have to say each and every game looked awesome you're also going to get the support of hdr and amd freezing so you can definitely make use of all of that but one thing to note is that you'll only get 120 hertz if you're hooking it up with an hdmi cable but by using the type c cable you can easily get up to 1 44 hertz so please bear that in mind so with this monitor you're also gonna get 100 percent of the dci p3 color space that means you're gonna get accurate colors for not just gaming you can use it for photo or video editing purpose too and if you're someone who likes to read a lot, you can use this for that purpose too. Now having a closer look, all your buttons and connections are on this side. So there is an audio jack if you want to connect your headphones. Then we have this two USB-C ports, a mini HDMI port and a controller for the settings. So setting this monitor up is very easy. All you have to do is connect it to your power supply and then plug in your Type-C cable which is connected to your laptop and the screen will automatically turn on now of course you can use it without the external power supply but today since i'm testing i'm gonna keep it connected now when it comes to the setting this is how it looks you can adjust the picture the color here you can turn the free sync on or off then we have the audio and here are some other options change your hdr option the aspect ratio etc and finally the option to select the input next i'll be testing out a few things here i'll be connecting a retro handheld emulator then i'll do some gaming on the laptop top as well as connecting it to my ps5 
So as a conclusion I would like to say that I really like this portable monitor and one of the best thing I like about this is that it's super thin so you can easily put it in your bag and carry it around and as I said in the beginning it's super easy to set it up as well and I have to say it has great resolution and the right refresh rate I'm looking for in a portable monitor. So at the end if you're looking for a portable monitor this is the one I would recommend and with that I would like to wrap up today's video please leave a like if you found this video helpful also consider subscribing to stay tuned until next time ciao